Hi, second graders. The last time that you were here, we were learning about an artist named Peter Diem, who um, was a Dutch artist, and he was known, or is known, I should say, he's still alive, for making paintings of kind of funny looking cows. So today we are going to continue on with our cow project. Last time we drew it and then inside the, the, the spots of your cow, your job was to make different designs um, using patterns. So today I will do the coloring demonstration so that we can finish up this project. And I will do that demonstration in just a second. All right, so I have already sharpied my cow and I've already erased my pencil lines. What I'm going to do now is start adding in the patterns and the designs into the different sections of my cow. So last time I already drew this one in, I am just going to trace over those lines now. And I believe last time I told you that if you wanted to leave those blank and just draw the designs in with marker, that you could do that this time. So. Um, that's what I'm going to do in the other spots. Now you want your designs kind of close together in the space so that it fills up the, um, fills up the, the spot quite a bit, if that makes sense. So I'm putting those lines close together because it look, makes it look like it's a little more colored in. Okay, so mine looks like that. And I would keep on going until I fill all the sections of my cow in. I shouldn't say all the sections because this part we're going to leave white. So all the spots of my cow. Something like this. And I would continue going in the rest of my spots. Okay, that's all there is to the project. So once you are done doing that, you are pretty much done with the project. I am going to color my tongue in though, just because I feel like that part of the cow does need to be colored in. All right, if you have any questions, please let me know.